Guys, it's time to unbox a sneaker, but like not really unbox a sneaker. You know what? Just watch the video. <laughs> TJ back with another video talks with TJ aka TJ Two Swoosh Change and Two Swoosh Crew. Truly appreciate you guys checking into the channel and this video. Now I'm not 100% certain when this video is going to go out. It may be Saturday when you're viewing this. Um, I already had content planned Monday through Friday trying to be consistent with that all of July. But anyway, you know, I appreciate you guys coming through. Uh, make sure that you engage in the comment section. I love, love, love to interact with you guys. Um, you can go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. If you're new here, just understand. If you don't hit that thumbs up, uh, I'm not offended, okay? You cannot please everybody. That is the motto over here, okay? And the second you stop trying to please everybody, you will find out you are a lot happier in life, okay? <laughs> this video, it's not particularly a sneaker unboxing, but it's kind of a sneaker unboxing so let me just uh let me just go ahead and give a thank you to ron reviews 2.0 okay he unboxed on his channel some sneaker prints that he had i think he got an off-white and i think he might have had a yeezy like a wave runner or a, a v2 that he now actually has framed and posted behind his setup when you guys are watching videos on his channel so i will be sure to link his channel below but he got these from crowned artist i will make sure to put that up here too so you guys can know to please go check him out on instagram i instantly wanted to check this artist out get a hand drawn sneaker done now just understand you can get prints done or you can get a hand drawn sneaker done but i also want to just make this very clear make sure that you are you have no problem paying an artist what they are worth okay there this is their craft this is their dedication this is their passion make sure that you are respecting that okay because i guarantee you his prices are gonna go up when everyone starts to see the amazing work that he does i've wanted some sneaker art for a while just hadn't ventured out to actually make a purchase yet and once i saw ron's and i saw this guy's entire page i mean you can't deny the quality of it so i'm not sure if you guys could guess what sneaker i did um i chose to get a uh, sneaker drawing of the bread toe to me this is the perfect sneaker creation uh, really paying homage to the og colorway that we know and love of the bread the black the red and the white but with this new color blocking that they did it's absolutely amazing we know the quality on here is amazing too from the side panel here to the toe box and i wanted to capture that in a drawing and you know what he did not disappoint so i'm gonna go ahead and take this out of the box Ugh. And show you guys. Now, I'm gonna go. I'll take it out of the plastic. That way, you don't have to get the glare from the plastic. So you guys can see. Now, understand. I'm gonna do some B-roll too a little bit later on, so this is uh, a little bit easier to see. But I mean, the details on this are incredible. It's insane. Look at that toe box. There's so much texture. There's texture all on the bottom. I mean, very similar to the shoe. Okay, it is identical to the actual shoe here. I, I couldn't have asked for better. It's kind of got that worn in look on the midsole there. And then you can just see the detail, highlights on the black leather, the tongue, the wings logo. So I am so excited about this. And Crown Artists, you did your thing. Thank you so much. You have no idea. Let me get this adjusted. Uh, you have no idea how much I love this. Now, my plan is to put it kind of right here behind me, but I gotta get the right frame, so you guys probably won't see it in maybe until like August or something. Once I get the right frame for this, I am I really love the larger glass frames that you can put uh, pictures in and they kind of float around in that open space. I think that would be amazing. Now, I'm already thinking about what sneaker I wanna have done by him next. So you, you guys gotta let me know what would you, you know what sneaker would you guys actually get done i haven't decided if i want to go with another retro would i want to go with you know a trainer like the air max one that og red and white colorway is something that i'm really debating getting done but i mean look at this and it's 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 pretty big hand drawn print so if you guys actually look on his page he would post the uh the 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 process of the progress that he had made on this actual drawing here for me and uh, I got more excited and more excited and more excited the closer it got to actually being done. It's here. It has arrived. I'm going to give you guys some close-up B-roll, so don't you worry. 
about that, but it's an amazing shoe, okay? Amazing shoe, amazing artwork. I couldn't have asked for better. So hopefully, I'm thinking the B-roll will do it the, the justice that it should be done. So make sure that you are supporting those that are putting out amazing work. And that's also to give a shout out to Sneakerhead's clothing line. You guys see me rocking the Sneakerhead vs. Hype B shirt. You already know, um, use code FIT Jeter Girl. That gets you 10% off $25 or more that you spend on the website. They just celebrated 10 years, which is amazing. Most businesses don't last two years. They don't last five years, but they have lasted 10 under Rep Milwaukee 404. That is his Instagram. Um, they have lasted 10 years under his leadership. Another great 10 to go, I am pretty sure. So many things on the horizon this summer. So as they start to roll out, he's kind of put some sneak peeks out on the channel or on the channel and on his uh, Instagram page. But as soon as they start to roll out, just know I will have those in. We will do, yep. Yeah. All that y'all gonna see all that okay but thank you for tuning in to this video again let me know in the comment section what sneaker would you have crowned artists draw up by hand for you to put up in your home having sneaker art up I mean listen art and decor should really um, tell the story of who you are and what's true to you and what's more true to me the sneakers right you guys already know I'm a sneakerhead day and night and now I got the drawing to go with it so thank you so much for tuning into this peace